it's going to be it'll be multimodal it'll be faster what, what you know who knows what the the thing that i think really matters is it's going to be smarter and this is a bigger deal than it sounds right sam altman ceo of openai has already started talking about chat gpt5 the next version and he says it's going to be better at everything across the board Altman provided insights regarding GPT-5 during his speech at the World Government Summit, claiming that the new model will be faster, smarter and more multimodal. However, what exactly does smarter GPT-5 mean? Imagine artificial intelligence having the ability to quickly and effectively perceive and interpret not only words, but also sounds, visuals and other types of data. The main idea, which has a very futuristic vibe to it, revolves around an AI that is capable of thinking by itself and creating other AI that is similar to it without the need for human supervision. Altman has made references to ChatGPT's enhanced general intelligence and its capacity to manage several types of data at once. This development has the potential to completely transform AI applications in terms of speed, effectiveness and dependability. There is no information available from Altman on a possible release date. It is speculated that GPT-5 will become Gobi, a multimodal AI model that will be released in the spring of 2024. It appears that a sizable dataset is being used for extended training of the model. The OpenAI chatbot GPT-5 is an upgraded version of GPT-4. What is expected to be even better is GPT-5. It will ultimately handle more content such as videos, be better customized for every user and generate fewer errors. OpenAI revealed Sora, an AI model that can produce minute-long videos in response to text cues. According to an announcement from OpenAI, we're teaching AI to understand and simulate the physical world in motion, with the goal of training models that help people solve problems that require real-world interaction. The startup OpenAI, a trailblazer in generative AI, is at a crossroad in the turbulent field of artificial intelligence. The tech industry has been rocked by Sam Altman's abrupt departure as CEO and the subsequent turmoil on the board. As the play progresses, important issues like board governance, the power relationships reshaping the digital industry, and the crucial role AI plays in the never-ending drive for innovation come to light. More alterations, enhancements and upgrades are planned for OpenAI's AI-powered chatbot ChatGPT now that Sam Altman is back in charge of the organization. In a recent episode of his Unconfused Me podcast, Altman spoke with Bill Gates of Microsoft about all things OpenAI, including topics such as the creation of GPT-5, superintelligence, the company's future, and more. Altman acknowledges that the team behind the well-known chatbot hasn't yet fully realized its potential. He noted in the same sentence that the group has advanced significantly in several areas, which is related to the achievements and breakthroughs that have occurred since ChatGPT's founding. Sam Altman informs Gates that ChatGPT users find the speech mode capability and image generation and analysis to be very popular. He also mentioned that the team is presently investigating user requests for the platform to have video capabilities. Given the great feedback on image and audio capabilities received during the release of AI-powered app, this will probably be quite significant for ChatGPT. The CEO did, however, state that the team's current primary area of focus is reasoning abilities. The GPT-4 model from OpenAI, Altman noted, is restricted in its reasoning capabilities. Additionally, he mentioned that the business is attempting to increase the chatbot's dependability so that it can respond to inquiries with accuracy. With the help of generative AI, incredible discoveries might be made that open up Hytherto undiscovered possibilities. All of these, though, come at a hefty price. We already know that OpenAI needs up to $700,000 per day to keep ChatGPT operational. This is in addition to the technology's excessive water usage, which uses one bottle to cool down each query. Users' fears about AI privacy and safety concerns are also quite real. Because of military concerns, the US government placed export restrictions, stating that the goal is to establish control over technology rather than undermine China's economy. This prevented chip makers such as Nvidia from selling GPUs to China. In the midst of its protracted struggle with China for dominance in the tech sector, the US government may tighten its hold and enforce more regulations to establish tighter control over the usage of technology. Sam Altman dreams and has ambition to becoming super intelligent, while OpenAI keeps enhancing ChatGPT and making changes. 
Superintelligence is essentially a higher level of artificial intelligence AI system than Microsoft Copilot and ChatGPT, surpassing human cognitive powers. It appears like OpenAI is already well on its way to accomplishing the amazing achievement, since employees of the business wrote a letter to the board of directors outlining a possible breakthrough in the field. If the discovery is properly utilized, the business may be able to get super intelligence in 10 years or less. Nevertheless, complex controls and safeguards must be put in place to guarantee that technology doesn't get out of control or end up in the wrong hands. The emergence of AGI rumors can be attributed to a tweet by Ilya Sewers in which she conveyed her profound joy without providing a precise explanation. Many others were interested in Sewers' tweet, including Elon Musk, who responded to it asking about a letter that was mentioned in a news piece. In his post, Musk conveyed gravel worry and alluded to the situation's possible seriousness. This prompted more research into the issue. It was found that a number of OpenAI staff researchers had written a letter to the board of directors, alerting them to an important AI finding that may endanger humankind. Reliable sources claim that the letter highlighted the development of QAR, a potent AI model and breakthroughs in AI algorithms. Researchers are optimistic about the model's future success since it has demonstrated outstanding capabilities in tackling mathematical problems. It was developed by OpenAI. Although it was a warning, the OpenAI researchers' letters also highlighted worries about the commercialization of these developments without fully appreciating the ramifications. The letter and other complaints apparently had an impact on the board of directors' decision to fire Sam Altman, the company's then CEO. Following this decision, there was a major upheaval in the company, with over 700 people expressing a wish to leave. OpenAI revealed that Sam Altman will be rejoining the business as CEO, which was an unexpected development. As the face of generative AI, Altman has played a significant role in the organization's progress towards artificial general intelligence. Employee reactions to his victorious return were conflicted. Some were loyal to Altman, while others harbored misgivings about earlier events and bold choices. Altman's return suggests that OpenAI's tactics and direction may be changing. At the center of the AGI conjectures is the QAR project, an innovative algorithm creation by OpenAI. The Q-Learning Algorithm for Reasoning, or QAR, has attracted a lot of interest in the artificial intelligence community. Despite its small size, this model has proven to be remarkably adept in applying reasoning to solve elementary school arithmetic problems. The potential of QAR to facilitate the development of AGI is what makes it significant. That's all for today folks. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to receive notifications. Also, express your valuable thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to spend some time watching the other videos on our channel. Bye for now.